So one of the first things I'd like to address is I find that when I'm improvising and whatnot that I'm constantly playing the same licks over and over again. Okay. And it gets kind of stagnant. And I was just wondering what advice you could give me on coming up with new type of things to play. I think are you, is the problem that you don't have any other ideas or is the problem that you just you, you have them but you can't recall them at the time or you don't know how to implement them or you're afraid of messing up or you know, what, what exactly is the problem here? Just can't come up with new stuff, I guess, especially right on the spot. So you, I always kind of revert back to the same old licks. And it's okay, so it's not that you, you play everything that you know and you don't know anything else? It's not that? Uh, or is it that? Yeah, yeah, I'd yeah? say it is that. So yeah. you're, you're, you remember it's everything It's like I don't that know how to hold playing. back type of thing. All right, let, let, let's hear Let's hear it. to me like you're actually playing anything yeah it's just kind of a bunch of random yeah they're just notes so 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 far I've, I haven't heard any actual idea so what I mean is that it's not like you have a, a collection of licks and you're playing those licks or you're not playing any licks you're, you're just you're just improvising just noodling with notes okay so so the reason why I'm pointing that out is this is not what you described so what are some of the? Th can you verbalize? Well, this is one of the other. This is one of the problems that I have as well. Is like it's just kind of random. Okay. Show, do you know any licks? Show me a lick on the guitar. Anything. Okay. Play that. Okay. So take that lick. Play it. And then, and then let's work on just getting some variations of that same lick, okay? Okay. Okay, So, because oh, otherwise, you know what happens? You got an idea, you, it's like a firecracker. You, have, you got the firecracker, you light it on fire, it blows up, and you're done. Now you go reach in the bag for the next firecracker, okay? We don't have to do that if that's what Lou was getting at, okay? than the first thing you did. And it's one, it's one idea. All right, now what would happen if we took a second idea and we did that same thing, and a third idea? Okay. You, don't know, you don't need to recall tons of stuff and then cram it all in there. And we also don't need to just mindlessly just kind of wander through the scales to pick out notes, you know, and by trial and error come up with something that sounds good. You know, we know that that lick sounds good. Right? Sounds good all the time. It's going to sound good over the A, chord, a minor chord. It's going to sound good over the F chord. That's a cool lick. It's been used billions of times. So let's, we'll just milk that one. Let's just take this. Just that. Okay, now you develop that. Okay? cool right there. Is that not cool? Is that cool, Lou? Very cool. It's cool. Do it again. You're a freaking rock star. about this is good yeah. what's your brother problem <laughs> what do you mean you can't you don't have ideas 
<laughs> this is great. Okay. Now, so we got we have those three basic things, right? So you remember those three? Okay. Make a solo on developing those three. Okay. The rant, rant, you know, just mix them up and do whatever. 